you have to go to Florida to eat on the beach. You can eat by the sand right here in downtown Detroit, and that's all thanks to Fountain Detroit, which is set up in Campus Martius. And joining us today is Chef Jordan Hoffman. Thanks for being here. Thank you for having me. We're so glad that you're here. So the first question is, are you the same as the Fountain Bistro? We are downtown? not okay. the same as the Fountain Bistro. The fountain, the space that was the Fountain Bistro, yes. right now we are renovating. It's awesome. totally gutted out. We're building a whole new brand new restaurant there. It's going to be fantastic. That's going to be opening up the fall. When we're going to have details to come on that. And as as we get as it gets there. As All right, good. There. Now that we've got that cleared up, let's talk about what we're cooking today. Yeah, so right now, down at the restaurant that we have right now, we are a really unique space down there. Mm -hmm. We're going to, uh, you can put the... Uh, okay, well, what are we making first? Let's tell everyone. We're going to make a falafel burger. Right. So we're kind of taking that uh, Middle Eastern classic, and we're going to do one that is as a burger. Right. And so it kind of fits with the theme of uh, what we do at the Fountain Detroit, which is kind of, uh, more of these, mm -hmm. uh, which is kind of upscale and reinvented casual classics that really fit into a beach setting. All right. So we've got our chickpeas and we've got our lentils in there. We're going to now go ahead and hit that pulse set. Low or high? Uh, go ahead and high. Damn. So we're going to grind all those up. Good? Good. Along right. with that, we're going to add some onion. Bam. We're going to add some chopped parsley. OK. We're going to add some baking powder. Mm. And then? And then this is chickpea flour. So that's going to help kind of bind it all together. And it, the, using chickpea flour also keeps it nice and gluten free. Yes. All right, so pulse some more. Pulse oh. some more. Now, who doesn't love a good falafel? I wouldn't have thought to make it into a burger. Yeah, why not? So it's, okay. it's a great patty. It's a great alternative to a hamburger. Okay. And, you know, it's we a, just threw some garlic in there, right? We just right? threw some garlic in there as well. Okay. So that comes out, and then we take this and turn that into a nice little patty. Okay. Which we've True. already got one that's in the fryer, because these take about so, six, seven minutes to fry. So that's what it'll as, look like. And as you, you patty it up. Look at that. We're going to pull it out of the fryer. So it goes from goes, this. It goes from that nice little paste to that into a nice. Right up deliciousness. Deliciousness, correct, yes. correct. And we'll get this out of the way real quick because we'll make the tahini sauce that goes with it. Okay. And we'll steal the plug. Bam. So describe for everyone why you would make tahini, because the majority of us, I feel like, just run to the to the local store of some sort and just buy a bottle of tahini. What's well, different about this? You know, we start with the fantastic tahini paste. Okay. And we go ahead and hit it with some lemon juice, a little bit more garlic, mm -hmm. and so we just make it just a little bit more. Easy. You zhuzh it up a little. We you zhuzh add it up. a little some levels to all of this. You know, we love the zhuzh here. All right. We hit it with a little bit of garlic. Okay. We're going to hit it with some lemon. And then you can go ahead and take that stick blender and go ahead and give it a buzz. All righty. Okay, a little bit more lemon. More lemon, let me just get in there, All right. So what does the lemon do to the tahini? Well, it, it just balances out the uh, citrus, it, it balances out the acid. Okay. So tahini is kind of rich. Think like it peanut very, butter rich. Right. So that little bit of acid kind of just balances us all, balance it's all out. All right. So now let's put this bad boy together. All right. Hey, so, Chuck. I made it. Here's look, a spoon for the look what I got ready for you. Oh, well, <laughs> right. you got a falafel burger. Yes. This is so awesome. We're, we're going to do some slices of cucumber. Awesome. We're going to do some nice slices of tomato. This looks about as clean and fresh as you would love to have your lunch. You know, huh? this is a fantastic clean and fresh lunch. Yeah. But at least we forget sometimes when you're at the beach, you want a little bit something more gluttonous. So we've, <laughs> we've All right, got, so we're running out of time. So let's put this together. We got 30 awesome seconds. Burgers, I want everyone to see the final awesome product. We've got awesome fries. We've got awesome uh, everything, you, everything you could want we've got down there. All so right. we've got All that, right. that. We're going to hit it with some that. tomato. Some cucumber. Boom. Cucumber. Yeah. Boom. Lettuce. This. Let's do it. Very nice. And then? Top it off that and you're is good. A, I've never your had falafel, falafel burger. burger. Falafel I've had many times. So <laughs> come down to Campus Martius. Come see all the great stuff we got going on. We got movies on Saturdays, uh, barbecues on, on Fridays, uh, live music almost every day. Fantastic stuff coming on all the time. If you haven't been down to the park recently, come on down and try some great food. Get some great cocktails. Enjoy yourself. There you go. Good Sounds to see good you. to me. This Thanks is very called much. lunch. Yeah. We'll be right back with more.